So as I'm sure most of you already know, the April Fool's event is in full swing, and we have some brand new little creatures to hunt, known as Robits. Now if you're unfamiliar with what a Robit is, it's basically a European rabbit with weird, enlarged roe deer antlers. They're certainly a sight to see. I'm actually really excited to hunt them, they're, they're pretty neat. I'm curious to see if they can be rare. I've yet to see, I've yet to see a rare one posted, so to my knowledge, None have been shot, but I would imagine that they can be with the same rare variants as the European rabbits. And I'm also curious to see if when you mount them, because right now they show up in the lodge with the antlers. I'm curious to see if after this event they'll keep the antlers, because those of you who played the last April Fool's event would know that the giant turkeys, after being mounted, they were giant during the event. But after the event, they shrunk back to normal size, which was kind of depressing, but hopefully our little robits keep their antlers. And I'm really, I've got like, burrows like right beside me. The dog's like over there pointing. So I think we're just going to go ahead and go see if we can smoke one. That has antlers on its head. Fired at a robit, so it does register when you shoot at them. That's pretty cool. It didn't look very big compared to the ones that I have seen, but... Oh, maybe I was wrong. That looks like a pretty nice robit. That actually looks like a really nice one. 1.9 kg. That might be one of the nicest ones I've seen so far, actually. We're gonna go ahead and trophy shot that for sure. That doesn't look too bad. These things are kind of annoying to pose in a way that shows off the antlers and also doesn't make the rabbit look stupid, but I don't think that looks too bad, so we'll go ahead and take that picture. I'm going to mount it just because I have the extra EMs and just in case I don't shoot a bigger one. And as you might be able to tell by the audio, I have somehow managed to get like three Euro rabbits stuck around me. Not really sure what they're stuck on, but they're definitely stuck. Oh, they added an are you sure you want to taxidermize the animal thing. That's new, I've never seen that before. Well, new-ish. New enough that I haven't seen it. I don't mount things very often, but that's a cool little feature because everybody always complains about the fact that they accidentally mount things, but let's see if we can smoke one of these rabbits as they run away. I'm assuming they got stuck on the, tr the trophy shot barrier would be my guess. It'd be the only theory that makes any sense to me. There's definitely a few of them. Uh, I'm not gonna get a shot on that guy. I think I got at least one over there. One just came out of the hole. There we go. I don't think there's any more robits in this colony, but it's cool that we got one. And yeah, I did get two rabbits over here. Not very big. Let's see what he got for this one. Uh, about the same size. We'll keep looking and see if we can find any more robits. I don't think there's any more in this colony, but I'm sure I'll be able to find quite a few more. The old pointer's pretty good at finding them, so I'm not too worried. I'll clean up this colony and then see if I can find another one. So we cleaned up the last patch of rabbits, and I've actually found a track from a robit at this next colony that the dog has led me to. Which is kind of neat, because I knew that they had their own spotting and tracking skill, but I wasn't sure if they were actually going to show up when you ID'd their tracks, or if they were just going to show up as European rabbits. So now I have confirmation that they do show up, which is a good thing to know, because you can just kind of run over to a colony and ID all the tracks if you're specifically going for robits. I'm just kind of hunting the rabbits and seeing what pops up, but it is a good thing to know. That one right there's not a robit, but... We'll shoot it anyway. Uh, oh, that one is a robit. A small one, though, by the looks of it. I don't think he had much for antlers, but... I do believe I saw some. Yeah, no, it did register as shooting at a robit. A little bit smaller antlers than the last one, and a little bit smaller weight as well, so he's going to score a little less. It doesn't look like the weight and the score are actually related. So they can have really big antlers and score really high, or have really, really small antlers and score really high. Which is kind of interesting. We're going to take a trophy shot of this guy, even though he's small. 
The hill really wasn't that helpful with this trophy shop, but regardless, it doesn't look too terrible, so we'll go ahead and sell that, because we're not going to be mounting that one. It's a lot smaller than the last one. Our trophy shop boundary trapped a bunch of rabbits yet again. I thought I heard one, but it was just a dog walking. I do believe we got this one over here, though. Yeah, we did. Actually, just about before we got down the hole, I didn't even see the hole there. 2.2 kg. That's not even a bad rabbit, but not quite trophy shot worthy. Now, I don't believe there's another robit here, but I'll clean these burrows up. Maybe run around and see if I can find a robit track now that I know that they will show up. Because it does look like there's still at least a couple rabbits left in here. So we found a new set of burrows, and we do have a confirmed set of robit tracks here. I don't believe there's too many rabbits in this little colony, so it shouldn't take too long for him to poke his head out. So we'll just wait here and see. Hopefully he doesn't take too long. And hopefully he's a nice one, I don't have the, uh, the weight estimates on the robot tracks yet. Oh, that was a regular one. I don't know if I got that second one or not, it would have been close. Oh, I did get it, awesome. Neither of them were robits, though, which means he's still in there somewhere. 2kg female, and 1.8kg female. So not too bad. Pretty decent pay for rabbits. No sign of the robit yet. I'm going to see if I can find his track again. Actually, I don't believe that I'm still on it. These are all regular European rabbits. There's actually a bunch of tracks here that I haven't even ID'd yet. There might be multiple robots. Okay, there we go. That's the track. That might have been him that popped out of this hole. Well, he's roaming, not fleeing. Interesting. Well, I guess we'll just wait. He's in there somewhere. He'll show up eventually. Oh, there we go. That's a robot. And I might be able to get that one. I don't think I got it, but... I registered the shot. Oh, I did get it, too. Awesome. We'll harvest this guy first. He's got the big boy set of antlers, which is pretty nice. We'll just see what he weighs in at. 2.0 kg, so that's going to be... 1959. That's bigger than our last one, and maybe even the biggest one that I've seen so far. We'll go ahead and trophy shot that. Alright, that looks pretty good. And as usual, we've got a bit of a group of rabbits outside that have been kind of restricted by the camera boundaries. Not really sure why that happens, but we're going to mount this guy too. And we're going to see if we can nag one of these guys on the run. I don't even see any of them. Oh, there goes at least one of them. Yeah, no, I screwed that up. We'll go grab this other one that we shot, though. I don't think those other two rabbits are anything special, but I will clean them out of the way just so they don't distract the dog in the future. Or anybody else that might join the map and try to look for the robots. Alright, so I decided to wrap it up there. Just a short video for today. I wanted to get a video on them out on release day and I worked all day so unfortunately I didn't have a whole lot of time to record this but it's still a little bit of something. I will be doing more on these guys for sure. I believe the events around until Monday. I'll probably be streaming them tomorrow and I'll probably do maybe another video on them a little more in depth. But for now, hopefully you guys enjoyed this and I'll see you guys in the next one.